something you don't see every day. Lemurs on the loose in South Florida. And these two didn't escape from a zoo. Local 10 News reporter Ian Margle is live in Cooper City with the story. Ian. They were first spotted at this park right around this time yesterday. One of them has since been captured, but the other is still out there. Those are no raccoons, and they aren't monkeys either. Those are lemurs on the loose in South Florida. I like to move it, move it. I like to move it, move it. I like to move it. You probably know about them from the movie Madagascar, which makes sense because Madagascar, the island, is the only place lemurs are supposed to be seen in the wild. But this duo was spotted at Flamingo West Park in Cooper City on Thursday. And then one of them was seen again by drivers in Southwest Ranches Friday morning. It requires a special permit from uh, FWC to maintain a lemur as a pet. Wildlife expert Ron McGill says they probably escaped from someone's home because while lemurs are non-native to our area, you can keep them as a pet. There are a lot of people who do have permits and do, do maintain lemurs. Uh, and they are very smart, so it's very feasible that one has escaped. The lemur in Southwest Ranches was caught by animal control and turned over to the Florida Fish and Wildlife Conservation Commission. But as for where the second one went, I like to move it, move it. that lemur is still moving it, moving it somewhere in Broward. If these two were together, now they're separated and the one that's remaining could be a little bit more frightened. Uh, these animals can give you a really, really nasty bite, so please don't try to approach it. And it is still moving it, moving it somewhere in Broward County right now. The other one is safe at a permitted facility while the FWC does their investigation. At the end of that investigation, the owners who have not come forward to this point could be cited. We will keep you posted. For now, we're live in Cooper City. I'm Ian Margle, Local 10 News.